and Tiny as the Chip is here, and we are back with Genshin Impact. Eventually, it will load. Hopefully. Theoretically. So, I was going to go back and do the thing, but... I figured I would do this shenanigans. You know? Sorry if I just went quiet. I heard some noises that I really am not fond of. And I'm really hoping it's not what I thought it was. But we'll find out. Okay. Um. So I just need to do this one. I'm not gonna lie. I'm doing just easy because... Like, it's 70. And then it's like 90. Sorry, I'm trying to read all these. Mm. You basically pick the two you're gonna let it let them do. doing my best here. I have so much shit to do and it's crazy. I got books. I got like five books to read. Actually no, six. Because one's a digital one. What is this about? I think I used up five, didn't I? So we'll see what this is. Oh, hi, Zo. <clears throat> That's cool. <clears throat> Got a shot. I can probably do no I can still only do three I'll have to get one more to get 20 hmm. I really want to get high, uh, Kave because Kave is cool This last one. We need the crown of insights. We need the crown of insights are good. Oh shit, that reminds me. Where's my phone? It's been a bit. I'm 
I'm worried. My friend has not responded to anything, and I'm worried that she's... I'm hoping she's just maybe busy or something. That's the hope. I'm Think you can get fun. away? No escape! Gather! Just let that take care of it. Oh, so sorry. Cool it! Ah! Ah! Time for takeoff. No one escapes my sights. I will have order. Probably should have waited. It's fine. Don't get frostbite. <coughs> like, but. Oh yeah, so like, one of the books I actually like, you know, discovered today is called Sherlock, Lupin, and Me. I think I mentioned it already, actually. And, um, this is actually the fastest time I've had for, um, this account. I think this, I think I got like 52 or something. 52 or 58 for my other account. But then again, I better get good numbers because I'm much higher leveled. And I have, like, my whole, all my cards on my main account are actually, or at least most of them are, like, you know, a lot more developed, if you will. Just start it off. It'll add it to it later once it's done. So that's that. Now the next one I need to go to is a particular, is like, like I did the first three, the second and third one for the uh, like thing because it was in the desert and I just did not care for it. So I was like, let me go do that, get that out of the way. Um. It is, where is that one? It's like something, I wanna, it's like over here somewhere, I think. That or it's near the other one, I'm not too sure. Like, I wanna, I don't know, I'm like, I'm not too sure, like, I'm kind of like in this weird state of like, I want to play this game, but then I also have, like, I don't, I don't know, I'm just, it's really hard to express what I'm feeling right now because it's just kind of like, <clears throat> I'm not too sure how to, like, you know, describe how I'm feeling because it's just kind of like, I don't want to say it's like blah. Gotta get this one. It's on the top part of the thing. I think that's where I'm at. Right? Yeah. I didn't know you were such a slacker. It's closer to down here, I think. me out. Oh. oh. That's right. I can't help do the r and r shenanigans because I am... I haven't finished doing this request. I think it's down here. really 98 if it's just basically on top of it. I 
remember looking for it and then just like doing something really stupid. And I was just Dodge like, this. huh? Solidify. It was like, I think, yeah, I remember it being Freeze. over there, like on that other side. But like, it was really stupid because like I was just like, what did I do? Like I did. Oh, I had like, I was like pretty close, and then I used Kaya as a R two and shit, and like. It was like, it like took a good chunk of my life. I was just staring there thinking, what's going on? <laughs> because I don't understand why I didn't think to like, you know, use my brain for like two minutes. Okay, so not that way. This way. That's basically all you did for that. Ooh. It's better to pick a taller character when it comes to... Why are they all like, floofy like that? Is it cause... I don't remember them being floofy in my other account. They were all like... Maybe it's the weather? Oh, kind of day. Ah, sorry guys, I did not mean to bother you. So, I didn't mean to bother y'all either. So, we're What's the to hurry? leave me alone, I'm gonna leave y'all alone, and then <laughs> everything's good and sandy. Eh. Okay. So, yeah, that's what's gonna happen. Sorry, I needed a moment because I was like, what time did I fucking do the thing? Uh, I gotta go to do the conclusion. Like, I sometimes worry about my own sanity. Can hey, that was not fair. I was stuck. Is that what bullshittery that was? We'll finish the other one. They are like beating the crap out of me, aren't they? Can I teleport directly to here? No, I cannot. Okay. So. Huh, why is this crack like that? Weird. Anyway. Keep losing my thought process. Oh, but I was reading, like, I have, like, okay, so, like, it was called Sherlock, um, Lupin and Me, which is basically, like, um, it's, um, basically, <laughs> like, um, um, a thing with, um, as if Irene was writing it, it's pretty neat. I kind of shit Sherlock and Irene, so, yeah. I think it's cute. A container holding a regular replica has been derived from the purple. Blue. That's blue. And it's red. So basically, fire, ice, and electricity. You got it. I have a... And if you... I'm not sure there's a situation where you fly... Fly nothing. And there's a waste of effort. Okay. So that's the end of that. And 
now we have to do the main mission of this. Come on, let's get moving. Thing. We're not frozen. Which is this one? No. This is place after all. Um, I gotta go back to the desert. I know, like, we started, like, we were, like, originally we were always gonna start here and continue on the main mission, but I was like, eh, I'll just do the quick fucking side missions. Because that's all I needed to get done. You know? So. I wonder if I should change their outfits. Eh. I'm talking about like in a twisted one that I'm pretty sure you can hear. It's it's little dingies. <laughs> As per usual at my constant needs. Kaya, I need you to get up the tree. You're going for those weird fruits on the top of it, eh? I know you use them for something, I don't remember what. Verification complete! Congratulations on being this round's first winner, Sino! Ooh, so Sino is the quickest! I am from Spontamon, after all. We know a lot about ley lines, so finding a disruptor was never going to be particularly difficult for me. Since the Traveler and Paimon also happen to be here, do you have anything you want to say? Anything I want to say? Hmm. My friend couldn't continue on, so failure was never an option. The bonds of yesterday will forge the road to tomorrow. <laughs> With the ties of friendship that bind us, I won't lose to anyone. <laughs> it sounds like fucking Yugi! <laughs> like, not even Yugi, Yami. He sounds like, um, Yami Yugi, or Dark Yami, or whatever you want to call him. It's like, he <laughs> Like, <laughs> sorry, I was just thinking about like my um, uh, my younger years um, and I was just like, haha, yeah. Well, I'm like, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I was in the Yu-Gi-Oh fandom, and you know what that means. I mean, don't get me wrong, I still like Yu-Gi-Oh, but I was that particular side of the fandom. You know, I mean, I, I'm all being all sly about it, but I've mentioned ships before, so I don't know why I'm pretending like, oh, you know. But yeah, like, I have, like, I had my ship, so I was like, this ship and that ship. Oh, I, speaking of Yu-Gi-Oh ships, I find it so weird. Like, I mean, not weird, and I get it, but I don't know why, like, the decision was to change the name from puppy shipping to violet shipping. Because originally it's, like, puppy shipping is, like, you know, goes based off on the, I guess, the nickname. And, like, violet shipping makes sense because blue eyes, red eyes, you know, it makes sense. That's a line from King of Invocations, one of my favorite works. And it sums up my thoughts right now. Fucking <laughs> you, you. It be a good thing that Tainari isn't here or else he'd give Sino a good smack right about now. It's so sad. <laughs> oh wow, it's already so late. Everyone's probably running low on food and water. It'll only get harder from here on out. Something similar happened in King of Invocations. <sighs> what a classic. Any He's thoughts such on a that, fucking Ohio? nerd. <sighs> I have no thoughts regarding King of Invocations. <sighs> Nero obviously wasn't asking about that. Deserts are much more dangerous at night, so this competition should be nearing its end. At the moment, only Farazan, Layla, and Kaveh remain. I wonder who the next person to find a disruptor will be. Wait, only three people are left? Tainari forfeited, and Sino's already done. What about Hackai? He also forfeited not long ago. Thinking at all. But like all Hatham said, the 
this round's almost over. Let's go see what the other contestants are doing. I don't... I find, like... Oh, look. You can talk to people. I didn't talk to anyone else. Are you all right? Much better. Aru Village's hospitality sure is something. Two whole pitchers of water, to be precise. If your throat's too wet as a result, I can provide some dry humor. No. No, no, thanks. Much appreciated, though. Gosh. No. I'm gonna talk to A. Hey, though. Things are really heating up now. You can feel the contestants' passion too, can't you all hate them? Compared to the abstraction of human emotions, the desert heat is easier to intuit. Tainari made the right decision to forfeit. Nothing. <laughs> eh. What are we doing? Oh, yes. I forgot what we were doing for like two seconds there because I was distracted. Just thinking. Anyway, but yeah, so I find it weird that they. Ch I mean, I get it for a newer generation. They. And I guess, like, I believe. No, actually, no. I think I vaguely recall reading something about it, actually. Now that one thinks of it. As I think of it. Um. If I'm not mistaken, from what I recall, vaguely recall. The reason why, I guess, they decided to change the name from Puppy Shipping to Violet Shipping is because Puppy Shipping came off based off, because of the insult. It was like, I mean, it's a nickname, but it's an insult, but then it also became cute, cute depending on the shipping. Um, um, depending on how it's written and blah, 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 blah. Because, you know, Joey or Katia, however you I tend, I, like, don't get me wrong, I used to use uh, Joey... But like, I do, and I do call him Joey. But like, I also use Katsuya when coming to writing fan fiction and stuff. Cause that is his Japanese name. But anyway, skipping off. Um, so but puppy shipping comes off like you know how uh Ka calls Joey, P or um or Katsuya or Cat or whatever, or Jonichi or Joe. Um, a dog. So, and you know, puppy is a cuter name of dog. So, and then. A lot of if there's a lot of insults calling Joey a dog and stuff like that. The puppy is a cute, you know, a cuter nickname, and it goes up based off the insult. And then you have well, violet shipping is like basically blue eyes and red eyes, like I said before. So you get off based off that, which I guess a lot of people have thought that was a much better alternative because then it doesn't come off an insult. And I think. I'm not too sure if any other shipping names have changed, though I think they really should change. You know, it suddenly occurred to me that you guys have had to do a lot of running around this time. Don't you find it tiring? Well, in that case, let's take a short breather here. The desert's getting colder now that night's falling, and the wind can really sting your face because of all the sand in it. Uh, has anyone finished this round yet? Sino's already shut one down. Have you made any progress yet? I circled the whole area, but I didn't find anything. But I did have the chance to think some more about that thing that was weighing on my mind. Well, my fellow Ritalahist members must have all put my name forward for different reasons. And maybe a lot of them only picked me because they wanted to watch me make a fool of myself. Wow. But be that as it may, I believe that a lot of them genuinely do expect great things from me. And I want to live up to their expectations. Uh, I don't want them to regret putting my name down. Huh? But doesn't thinking like that put a lot of pressure on you? Uh, of course, that comes with some amount of pressure, for sure. But now I've thought about it, I don't feel like this is something I have to do. Instead, it's something I want to do. That may not sound like a huge difference to you, but it's helped me relax a lot. <sighs> so don't worry oh, about me. Oh, why did I do that? Well, that's great! 
Also, now that I've relaxed, I'm suddenly really sleepy. Uh, I think I'll just take a quick nap. Just a quick one. <laughs> But the competition isn't over yet. <laughs> oh, Layla, Layla. She's really a bundle of nerves, isn't she? Wait, what? you're... Sleepwalking? Uh, good to see you, too. Ooh, it's nice to be out. Feels like I've been cooped up inside for quite a while. Well, since I'm here, I guess I should help her finish this. What are we supposed to be doing here again? It's like a multiple Finding a ley line disruptor, was it? Let me see. Hmm. Looks like she's basically gathered all the information she needs. Ah, oh, it won't take long to wrap this up. Come with me, you two. So. Do you ever get the feeling that the Lee lines have a regular flow? Similar to the way that celestial bodies follow fixed orbits. If we were looking down from on high, I wonder whether we'd find that the Lee lines are just the reflections of the stars upon the Earth. Not all astrological phenomena can be directly observed. Some are deductions based on other details that we know. It's the same situation with the Lee lines. The parts of them that are hidden underground can be identified via elemental energy, sound, and other phenomena. I didn't even know she had another Plus, part. Plus, now that someone has shut one of the disruptors down, the contrast between before and after can provide me with further information still. <sighs> Let me see. It should be here, I think. Where are we going? Ah, this should be it, right? I'll turn it off. That should restore the ley lines in the area to normal. Nice work! She knocked off Again, I didn't do any of the real work. I'm just wrapping up. She'll probably wake up soon. No doubt she'll be a little disoriented at first, but once she's got her bearings, she'll go and report that she shut down this disruptor. <sighs> Will you be staying here for a while? Or are you going to check on the other contestants? I keep hearing oh, time to check our locator. Whoa, it looks like Kave and Faro's on are headed towards the same place! Perhaps they're about to find the last disruptor. Also, speaking of Kave, He's an interesting one. Three. Sino uh, has three. Why do you say that? Before the second round, he had a chat with the other me. He said that worries can be like illnesses. They don't always have a magic cure. Sometimes you just have to endure them as best you can until they run their course. But the way I see it, his situation is much worse than my other selves. She just hadn't found what she wanted to do at the moment, which is why she felt lost. Kaveh, meanwhile, knows what he wants to do. He's convinced that he has to win, and yet he still seems conflicted. He doesn't have a second personality, but somehow he still seems that he's at odds with himself in some way. Uh, I don't know exactly how to describe it. It's like he's smiling on the outside, but there's no joy inside, only sorrow. Still, who knows? He must be more experienced than me. Maybe he's just better at dealing with it all than I am. Hmm. Uh, oh, but back to the topic of wrapping up. Shouldn't you be getting back to the action to record how everything plays out? Last one, then the round's over. Oh, true. Okay then, guess we'll be going now. We'll keep everything you said in mind. I just had Kave to start. were super confident at the start, but it turns out they're the last ones to find the disruptor. But between the two of them, who's going to get there first? Hmm. Let's head over quick. I'm trying to think about the point system. 
because Tanari has three. Arizon has two. I didn't know you were such a slacker. Layla has two. Kaveh's gonna get one. Spoiler on who went, who gets it. If you didn't know. Okay, so yeah, if he wins the next round, that's four. What's the hurry? And then that leaves what? What does that leave? What does that leave us? Ah! Fuck. Okay, now I got it. Cool beans. Okay, cool. Why are y'all there? Fuck's sake. And then I'm also in a hole, so. They just had to be somewhere where I couldn't get them. Okay, so. Ah. Hmm. Come on, let's get moving. Actually, We're not frozen in place. I'm gonna get all. a little closer, but I'm not gonna actually get there. Because I do hear my cats. Or a cat? Okay. My baby. No there. I'm over here. Go away. I'm not even bothering you. The fuck? A little man? It's an old man. Hello? Anyway. What's the hurry? Um. So, yeah, I'm gonna end What's this here and go check on my cat, because I think I hear her, her outside. Let her in. And then deal with that shenanigans, and then also go deal with Kaveh and um, Barazon over there. So, yeah. For now. Actually, hold up. I'm gonna try something. There they are. Anyway, for now, Tiny Switchy Pieces is setting up.